to Business Standard Morning Bulletin. Today we focus on Samsung Electronics plans to launch a faster Galaxy S4 smartphone that will transmit data at nearly twice the normal speed. J.K. Shin, head of Samsung Mobile Business and co-chief executive of the world's biggest technology firm by revenue, said the phone would be sold in South Korea as early as this month. Samsung was in talks with several overseas carriers to take the phone, Shin told Reuters. However, he declined to name the carriers. We'll be the first with the commercial launch of the advanced 4G version of the smartphone, said Shin. The new S4 will use LTE advanced 4G technology and upgrade from the conventional 4G called LTE or long-term evolution. LTE advanced offers data transmission at up to twice the normal 4G speed. The phones will be powered by Qualcomm chips. A movie download that takes three minutes with conventional 4G would take slightly more than one minute, Samsung said. Samsung's shares have lost almost $20 billion since June 7th after analysts cut forecast for Galaxy S4 sales by as much as 30% on the industry data that showed the high-end smartphone market was getting saturated. The same problem is hitting sales of the iPhone 5 made by Samsung's rival Apple Inc. Samsung's market capitalization is still a hefty $195 billion. Shin showed little concern about sales prospects for the S4, which hits stores in late April. The mobile device division is the company's biggest profit generator. Shin declined to provide forecasts for S4 sales but said the new model would be slightly more expensive than the current one. The South Korean firm hopes the addition of hardware offerings such as faster data transmission, along with its widely anticipated move to introduce models with unbreakable or flexible displays, will help it protect margin. As operators seek to provide more data-centric mobile services, I think this will become mainstream 4G technology globally in the coming years, Shin said. Shin also said sales of Samsung's tablet products in the U.S. market jumped 3.3 times since it installed brand shops with Best Buy's stores in April and is now considering expanding the format in Latin America and Britain. That's all for now. Thank you and join us again for the afternoon news bulletins.